I'm officially in Spain. Originally, I never planned to move overseas. My parents suggested it when my sister decided to move, but I was very adamant that this wasn't for me. But um, here I am. So it started when we dropped my sister off to Spain last year, and I say dropped very lightly. We flew to Spain for six weeks to hang out, um, get a view of what her life will be like and enjoy the city and even go to Paris. After that six weeks was up, we moved back and we were all just a little bit lost. Nothing was really tying us to the coast. Dad was already selling his business, so we decided to move as well. We rented out our house, got everything packed, put a lot of our stuff on freight and we jumped on a plane and we moved overseas. I'm now in my apartment and it's amazing. I have a balcony and a bathroom and I overlook a beautiful street view of bakeries and shops and I'm in awe. Seriously, the Christmas decorations as well. I feel like I'm living in a Christmas movie. probably back in lockdown, it's so hot and cold here. so strict we were actually lucky enough to go to Sitges for a day which was like a half an hour train ride it wasn't very long and we just chilled out on the beach it's so peaceful there when comparing it to the city I think we all literally fell asleep on the beach for a good hour it was just so beautiful lucky to be able to go to Menorca. It was just before lockdown and we got to go for four days. We had a house. There was a group of us probably about 10 I think and it was truly one of the best trips I've been on. I was really anxious to go, not gonna lie. Traveling with a group of people who I don't know really well, all living together um, and I'm definitely not the biggest party or most outgoing person so I was really not sure how I was gonna go but there was just this one Point of the trip where I was just so grateful I went. We hiked up like the side of a cliff. We did so much cliff hiking and jumping, which I was not prepared for. But yeah, this one night, I think it was the second night we were there, and we had a lot of drink in our hand because it was like happy hour sunset. And 
and we did, we watched the sunset on the side of the cliff face and it was just breathtaking. It was that moment I was like, this is why I wanted to push myself for moments like this. grateful to be here with my parents and my sister even though this year had not turned out exactly how it was supposed to I am still really grateful and counting my blessings no, 